Assalamu alaikum. Hello, my dear students. How are you? Hope that all of you are fine by the grace of Almighty Allah. Welcome to the online class of Milestone College. This is Mohsin Kobil, lecturer, Department of Biology, Milestone College. My dear students, today I am here again with some new topics. Our today's topics are selected from chapter 2. The name of the chapter is Introduction to Animal. Type Animal, Hydra. So our today's topics are Systematic Position of Hydra, External Structure of Hydra, Mesoglia and Sedentarum. So my dear students, these are the basic topics that I will discuss today. After completing today's lesson, students will be able to learn systematic position of Hydra. Students also will be able to learn what is hypostome, what is mesoglia, what is serenterum and also will be able to describe the external structure of Hydra. So my dear students, let's move to the class. So today's first topic is systematic position of Hydra. Before know this, I am going to give you some basic information about Hydra. Hydra is a freshwater animal. The Swiss scientist Abraham Tremblay at first discovered the animal Hydra and Carolus Linnaeus, the scientist Carolus Linnaeus gave the name Hydra. There are uh, about 40 species found over the world. Among them, three species, three species are available in Bangladesh. So let's know the systematic position of Hydra. Hydra, the kingdom of Hydra is Animalia, Phylum Nidalia, it is a diploblastic animal, so it is belong to the Phylum Nidalia. The class of Hydra is Hydrozoa, and the order of Hydra is Hydroida, family is Hydridae. And the genus is Hydra and the species is Hydra vulgaris. This species is available in Bangladesh. Now the external structure of Hydra. Body of Hydra is look like a cylindrical shape. It has a remarkable contraction and expansion power. It can be seen with normal eyes or open eyes normally because it is 10 to 30 millimeter in length and 10 millimeter in wide. Body of Hydra are radially symmetrical. Body of Hydra divided into three regions. Hypostome, trunk, and pedal disc. So now we are going to move the different body parts of Hydra. First one is hypostome. The oval end of the body bears a conical elevation, which is called hypostome, and it bears a round shaped mouth and hypostome is surrounded by 6 to 10 slender hollow thread like processes. This thread like structure are called tentacles. The tentacles of hypostome help in frame and locomotion and mouth 
help in engulf the food. Next one is tran. Second one is tran. The body region between hypostome and pedal disc. This elongated part is called trunk. Trunk bears gonad and bud. In breeding season, uh, oral end of the hydra bears testis and proximal end of the body bears a uh, oval shaped ovary. The proximal end or aboral end of the body also bear a bud. A well developed bud has tentacles, hypostome and trunk. A well developed bud when detached from the parent then an individual hydra is formed. The trunk help in locomotion by creating loops. Next one is pedal disc. The proximal end of the body drawn into a disc shaped slender stock which is called pedal disc. Pedal disc secrets adhesive fluid for the attachment of the body and also pedal disc secrets the bubbles for floating. So this is the external structure of body uh, hydra. Now mesoglia and cilenteron. Mesoglia is basically found in diploblastic animal. The word mesoglia is originated from Greek word meso means middle and glia means glue. So the jelly-like transparent and elastic layers between epidermis and gastrodermis is called mesoglia. The thickness of mesoglia is 0.1 micrometer. It's a continuous layer extends over the body. It is thickest in basal portion and thinnest in tentacles. Mesoglia act as the endoskeleton of the body. It gave uh, the definite structure of the body. It is also act as basal line foundation of epidermal and gastrodermal cell. It also helps in contraction and expansion. Next one is <clears throat> cilenteron. What is cilenteron? The central cavity of the body which is surrounded by or enclosed by gastrodermis is called cilenteron. This Cavity, central cavity of the body is called cilenteron. Cilenteron performs different types of physiological function. Extracellular digestion takes place in cilenteron. <clears throat> it also transport excreting wastes. It is transport respiratory gases. That is why uh, this cilenteron is also known as gastrovascular cavity. So my dear students, some homework for you from today's discussion. Our today's homeworks are systematic position of hydra and definition of mesoglia and cilenteron. Please do the homework regularly and submit the homework to your subject teacher or respective HW group. My dear student, I hope all of you understood all the topics that I discussed today. Yet, if you have any questions, please ask your respected subject teacher.
So that's all for today. Thank you for being with me. Stay home and stay safe. Allah Hafiz.